In this tutorial, we will guide you on how to use the date and time functions in MySQL. There are various functions which can be used for calculating the date and time in MySQL, but for the purpose of this tutorial, we will use three primary functions. We will be using SQL yog for this tutorial. Now let's start with the date functions. First of all, let's write a query for showing the current date. For that, write the select keyword followed by cur date, a pair of parentheses and a semicolon. Press F5 after selecting the query to execute it, and you will get the result below the editor showing the current date. Cur date over here is a short form of current date. Now if you want to view the date in a specific format, you can use a function called the date format. Write the date underscore format function in a similar pattern, but this time inside the parentheses. We will write the date with single quotation marks and then specify the required format in single quotations after a comma. Here we will use W for week, M for month, and Y for year, which are implicit format specifiers in the MySQL environment, used with a percentage sign. Now let's execute the query and see the output. If you want to know the day on a particular date, you can use the day name function. For that, write the day name function followed by the select keyword and specify the date within single quotes inside the parentheses. Now let's execute the query and you can see the day being displayed below the query editor. Now let's move to the time formats. First of all, let's find out the current time. For that, we will use the cur time keyword, which stands for the current time, and write the query in the same way as we did for the current date. You can see over here that the output being displayed is in the 24 hours format by default. Now let's see how we can change the format for the output. For that, use the time underscore format function, and now we can write the query in the same way as we did for the date format. Over here, H, L, and S are used for hours, minutes, and seconds, respectively. Now what if you want to convert the time into seconds? For that, write time underscore two underscore sec, along with the select keyword in the beginning, and specify the time inside the parentheses within single quotes. When we execute the query, you can see that the time is being displayed in seconds. Lastly, to display the current date and time together, we can use now function along with the select keyword. And that's it.